Good morning, everyone. We are getting ready to head up to the Sequoia Park, National Park, and uh, do some hiking, camping. Hello. Hello. Good morning. So I'll just tell everyone that we're getting ready to go. Yeah. We're heading to another adventure. To the mountains we go. And we are... We're leaving uh, two and a half hours later than when we planned, but hey, we're just chilling. Yep. Oh, it's broken. <laughs> this one works. <laughs> Is it? Yeah. <laughs> Go figure the first, the first, uh, oh, we have gas. Yeah, we're not putting here. This is really expensive. Actually, four dollars and seventy-seven cents. Alright, so we uh, decided to stop here. We went through the Hume Lake Village area. They have like Christian camp uh, grounds there, like a store and stuff. Behind me is Hume Lake. Uh, as you might be able to see, there's ice covering it still in some parks. Uh, nice little community area, but it's like, it's really, really beautiful up here. Uh, there's trails, there's a Hume Lake trail. Uh, I want to say it probably goes around the whole lake or something. There's people running on it, so this it's pretty nice. So we're just gonna take some time and uh, check out the lake. Just soak in the beauty. Yeah, just soak in the beauty. I mean, the lake itself ain't really that big, but it looks so amazing. It looks really crazy with all the ice on top of it. I know I don't want to be swimming in it. <laughs> it looks cold, but it, but it looks uh, it's really really beautiful. So we're. We're gonna stop real quickly. We're gonna air down the tires in the truck because there is ice and snow for I don't know how much longer. Some areas are getting kind of slippery. It's probably at a 18, might have to air down to 15, I don't know. So we're gonna air down real quick. Uh, I have these preset at 18 PSI. Uh, if we still need to lower them down a little bit more, we, we can. Um, these are like the Ston air deflators you just have them preset like the air pressure that you want you screw them in and they'll deflate into the psi that you want it to uh, deflate to If this doesn't work, we should try putting this one on the rear one. That's why. Let's do it. Okay, that. Want some more? Okay, that's it. Oh my god, I'm so exhausted. 
Look. Yeah. There's me and I, ooh. And that is, well, there was where the frame was on that side. Yeah. So, leave the, so the reason why I want to put it on both rear tires is in the rear I have a locker. So they both spin. So I guess, I guess that little bit helped. Huh? Okay. So the front, so if we would have had a front lockers, then that probably would have worked in the front. But only like one tire was spinning and it's not that strong. So, so, uh, well, it's, it was a successful one. <laughs> <laughs> we, we, uh, I guess they work, huh? I guess, the, I guess the high pace, all that, you know? Yeah. First time using this one. It, uh, we want to review it, but not like this, <laughs> like not this way. There's, there's only one way to, to do it, huh? Holy crap, that's oh a deep hole. Okay, so I guess we're not going that way. No. <laughs> should get the shovel and let's go. Yeah. Oh my god. All right, so uh, heading back towards like uh, Hume Lake, we found this awesome camp spot. It's got a fire ring already, and someone's already been camping there before. It's not in the snow around it, but it's not in the snow, so that's a bonus. Uh, there's also a creek, and it sounds really, really relaxing. And it sounds like we're gonna sleep really well tonight. Oh my gosh, we're good. Mm -hmm. mm. How was it? It's actually amazing. So good. Yeah. Uh, I don't know if I'm hungry. We are it's hungry. Really, really good. <laughs> but yeah. Oh man, it's a great breakfast. No, it's already <laughs> afternoon. <laughs> it's a brunch or something. Yeah. I have to give a shout out to Eric for this awesome igloo cooler. It's got like a little roller thing. You can actually take it off the roller. Makes it easy to move. Lemon mm. Oh my god. It's good. <laughs> oh, that wow. seasoning is good. Thank you, George. Mm. My friend George bought this from Oklahoma. It's called uh, Eskimo Joe's seasoning. Oh my god, so good. It's so good. Mm. Step back. We want to unwind, relax, no social media, no news. It's a good break from everything. Like, the world is crazy right now, and all you see is negativity. So it's nice to just be here with just the sound of nature. Good morning. Uh, hey, this is our view. <laughs> crisp, cold view it's so cold <laughs> <laughs> no, no french press huh? no french press coffee no <laughs> coffee is the best in here first cup of coffee for today yeah. good morning it's so cold <laughs> it's really really cold it's really really cold really 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 cold our I have hands so they're not warm <laughs> our hands are freezing this is our coffee. This is a Filipino coffee, guys. Copico Brown, which I showed earlier. It tastes so good. Especially right next to the fire. Good morning, everyone. It is a brisk, cold morning over here. <laughs> really cold. It's getting better. The fire is good. My hand warmers are warming. And we have warm coffee. It was quite an experience. It was. We used the buddy heater, which kept our feet warm, but I think we made a mistake of keeping the rain fly propped open on our tent and was just allowing the cold air in. And you know, that's that, you know, you can feel the breeze. And on top of that, our sleeping bags. Well, I think we need to get the zero degree ones, especially if we plan on camping in like Colorado, Canada, 
in Alaska, obviously. It was, it was, I would say it was pretty cold. We had, you know, your head's tucked in your sleeping bag, but it was, uh, we did everything we could to, to keep warm. We made it through. Maria said uh, her hand warmers, I didn't have hand warmers last night, but Maria had hand warmers, and she said that saved her. Lifesaver. <laughs> <laughs> we'll probably start packing you up, cleaning you up, and uh, get out of here. Take me on a treasure hunt I long for something new Have you heard the fairies when they sing and dance? Oh, I wish it was me Alright, so we cleaned up camp, uh, we walked around, picked up trash that we didn't leave, somebody else did, um, put out the fire, smothered it and all that, so now we get to head home, we have to uh, air up the tires once we get past all the snow and stuff, but other than that, yeah, we'll be on our way home, let's go. Let's go. In the words of Yvonne Chouinard, it's not an adventure until something goes wrong. And to us, that is true. Now everything always goes with the plan. Although we didn't reach our planned destination, we were still able to enjoy and spend quality time together. Facing issues on the road only makes the adventure memorable. We get to experience and learn new things, and that is why we truly believe that the journey matters more than the destination. Thank you for watching our video. Until next time, take care and God bless.